today we have the pleasure to have a, a little legend, Mahasin. She's a such character. She knows what she's going to be and uh, to become since her childhood. She, she was born in a, a family of physicians, scientists, and uh, well, I'm not revealing any secret about her genome because she has a gene of medicine since the childhood. Um, same welcome to Morocco. This is your first visit, and uh, we have a great privilege to have you talking about this sequence and therapy in hormone uh, castration resistant prostate cancer. You are a professor of medicine, you are uh, your, uh, a genus urinary cancer specialist and ex international expert with a special interest in bladder and prostate cancer. You have written more than 300, more than that, I guess. <laughs> I don't, it's countless now. So that's what I yeah, say. Yeah. Sleep, sleep is overrated. Yeah. So don't sleep. Uh, <laughs> on uh, different topics on process cancer, and you have a lot of book chapters. We have trained so many fellows and young faculties. Some of them are now holding key positions around the world. Uh, you have been awarded the, the, the most exceptional woman in medicine. You have been one of you are uh, rated as one of the giant in cancer care. So so many hours I can I, I can go on and go on. The list is <laughs> limitless. Okay, so Maha, you will be talking about uh, sequencing therapy, and uh, we are all uh, here to to learn from you from your experience. You can see from the audience that uh, uh, male to female ratio is changing in Morocco, and more and more uh, female are now getting uh, involved in the field of oncology and radiation oncology, and probably in the future, even in urology. Thanks for me. <laughs> sure. Maha, <laughs> it's a pleasure Thank to have you. Marhaba, Nvik. So I do have to say I'm biased, and I always say girls will save the world, so <laughs> that's what's going to happen. So uh, thank you so much, uh, everyone, and I really want to thank especially um, uh, uh, Dr. Ezzedine and Dr. Zin for their hospitality and uh, everything. It's really been a pleasure. I've never been to uh, the whole continent of Africa, let alone one country. This is my first visit there, and you have a wonderful country, beautiful, everything, lovely um, uh, people. Uh, I still have to get used to the accent. 